This video will demonstrate how to properly delime the water and spray head due to mineral deposit buildup. It is not necessary to disconnect the water source for this procedure. Disconnect power from the brewer and allow the faucet to cool to touch. Could take several hours. Run water out of the faucet until the flow stops. Elevate the front of brewer about 1 inch so water is confined to tank. The nut is only hand tight but may need the use of a hand tool. Exercise caution, as any residual water may be hot. Using a bristle brush, clean the faucet body to remove any mineral deposit buildup. Remove the old faucet seat cup from the faucet handle stem. Install a new seat cup on two faucet handle stem. Ensure the seat cup is securely fastened to the handle stem. Reinstall the faucet components and rotate the bonnet nut clockwise until it's hand tight. Return the brewer to a level position. Restore power to the brewer. Check for leaks around the faucet. Run water through the faucet until there are no signs of dislodged mineral deposits. Remove and thoroughly rinse the spray head. The holes must be open and clear of any mineral deposits. Insert the long end of the spray head cleaning tool into the spray head fitting and rotate several times to remove any mineral deposits from the fitting. Include the vent hole and the spray head panel. The use of a damp cloth rinsed in any middle non-abrasive liquid detergent is recommended for cleaning all surfaces on bonomatic equipment. Insert the short end of the spray head cleaning tool into each of the water outlets of the spray head to remove any mineral deposits. Reinstall the spray head. In hard water areas, this may need to be performed daily. It will help prevent mineral buildup in the brewer and takes less than a minute. If you experience a low flow of water out of the faucet after performing maintenance, contact a qualified service technician.